you scared the heck out of me. Go ahead. I'm watching a scary movie. I'll be out in a little bit, okay? My son scared the shit out of me, yo. <laughs> it's 5 o'clock in the morning. I don't know why I'm doing this. I, I don't know what possessed me to do this, but I'm going to do it. Uh, this is day two of my scary movie, uh, scare thon for 30 days or 31 days. 30 night, 31 nights. I'm not sure how many I do. I might check it out and just only do 30. I might not even get to 30. We'll see. But uh, first movie I just watched was uh, The Ring, which was good. It, it, it wasn't too bad. But this one is one of these ones that I remember seeing bits and pieces of it when I was a kid. Um, and I was like, nope, not doing it. Not doing it. Here I am. 30 some years later, I'm about to do it in a setting where I'm by myself. Everybody in the house is asleep. It's still dark outside at five o'clock in the morning. So I wouldn't be, I, I'll put you this way. It wouldn't be no hesitation if I was, you know, watching it light out in a couch setting, but I got the monitor right here. I'm gonna be locked in, you know, and I'm by myself. Everybody in the house sleeps. So it's like, if I hear some shit, I'm gonna paranoid i don't know but anyway let's get to it um just also know if you want to support or watch this in uh unedited watch the whole movie with me you know consider becoming a member you get member shout outs as you can see some of my members at the bottom of the screen um your name can pop up there you know um but also you get to help me determine uh what movies that I do watch, so if there's any scary movies that you do want me to watch, consider becoming a member. That will help to dictate what I will. Um, with that being said, let's go ahead and get to it. Um, I probably should have ate first, but anyway, here we go. It's starting off with creepy ass music already. Alrighty. I need to work on his asthma too. He don't seem like a big guy. That's loud. Uh oh. Oh man, she's one running terrible. <laughs> oh shit. You okay, Tina? Hell no. Nah. You see me? Kind of nightmare I'm having. Not a dream, judging from that. That kind of dreaming. One or the other. She look high as shit. <laughs> yeah, next time you have one, just tell yourself that's all it is, right? Where you have it. Oh shit, that's Johnny Depp right there. Holy the shit, name. look how young my man look. Uh, just some kids drag racing outside, I think, Mom. <laughs> oh wow. Wow. Hang up the phone. No, just some neighbors having a fight, I guess. I'm fine. I'll call you in the morning. Wow. That didn't work out right. <laughs> Actually, they were more like finger knives or something. Something he'd made himself. Oh, he shit. Made a horrible sound. Spooky. Nancy, you dreamed about Look at the sweater vest that was made by Nike. That was a, that's a Nike sweater vest. They don't make sweater vests no more. Like I've never seen a Nike sweater vest. Oh look, even a Nike regular t-shirt shirt is a Nike shirt. Nike was just putting out anything at that point. Oh, oh shit! Oh. down just three yards from the goal line. Maybe a funeral, dickhead. Oh, shit. It's just a sleepover day, Oh, Rod. shit. Tina and me. Glenn was just leaving. No more nightmares for either one of us, then. Damn. Well. When did you have a nightmare? Oh shit. Something outside. It's a cat this time, for real. Or a raccoon. Oh, damn. I heard that real loud in my left ear. Or is this a dream? This is definitely a dream. Who do you think you are? Mm -mm. See? 
Seven year old me could handle this. Damn, you going pretty far out. Especially with no damn shoes on. My man's got some ass skin. Ooh. Need to lotion that shit, bro. <laughs> oh. Please, God. We're <laughs> running. <laughs> Watch this. <laughs> oh, just pulled off a top layer of skin. Wake her ass up! Wake her ass up! What are you doing? Oh, shit. Oh, I thought she was the main character. Holy shit! Damn! Damn! Holy shit! That's fucking wild. Time out, time out, time out, time out. So, <laughs> I was like, this this movie's gonna be a piece of cake. Like, when I seen him in the alley just now, and he was chopping off his fingers, it's like, oh, this is, this is actually kind of comical. You know, seeing how they running and shit, and then the long arms. I was like, yeah, this is not gonna be bad at all. But that scene... That was that was a little bit intense for 19 what was it 87 when 85 whenever this movie came out that was I could pre I'm pretty sure that shit freaked out a lot of people like cuz I even right now like that was a little that was creepy that was that was crazy man they they did really great with the effect back then they well they didn't really have effects they uh you know they they had to really do this shit so that's crazy Kill you. Who did this? Reacher now. What's the car Something Oh, that's like old dude from uh, Enter the Dragon. Was found at the scene. Okay, so this is his daughter. How you doing, baby? I'm okay, Daddy. Nah, she not freaked out enough. Right, I don't want to get into this now. I thought Tina was gonna be the I main character. Alone. <laughs> she was the first victim. They're gonna kill me for sure. Nobody's gonna kill you. Nah, they gonna kill you. Did you do it? I never touched her. I'm warning you. Just move away from us, son. Ah, oh, shit. Real easy, like your ass depended on it. <laughs> Hold it! No! Jesus Christ. Damn. He was about to blast his ass. Operating in nature. She looks familiar. That's inside human nature itself that was rotten. A canker, as he put it. It's her now, voice that sounds familiar. To this, and to his mother's loss. Oh, shit. Is that, uh... The same is true in a different way in Julius Caesar. John, will you go ahead, please? That's the lady in, um... We, we, we've been watching... What's that sh movie called? Uh... In the most high and palmy state of Rome... Insidious. Air, I think that's the lady from Insidious. Style. Grave stood tenantless and I'm gonna look it up. Dead, did squeak and gibber. Hmm. Oh, she sleep. Holy shit. Oh. Tina? Oh, shit. I'm not following this. Mm -mm. Tina? Nope. I'm not going towards it. I am not. Looking for so, so they don't obviously they don't know that they sleep. No running in the hallway. Oh, hell no. <laughs> is he gonna kill her while she's at school? Nina? See, this is why they're not having black people in this in these movies because we're not investigating, we're not doing it. Mm -mm. 
We are not doing it. So who's the main character? Like, are there are there main characters in this? Like, is someone gonna survive? Is everybody gonna die? Like, because I just knew Tina was the main character. Is she the next victim? Oh shit. She about to die in school. Who are you? Ugh. <laughs> you just like doing random shit. I'm gonna cut my fingers off. Chop off my nipple. <laughs> See, this part is funny. Like, this this is part I can handle. The chase. Like, how they running. It's the death scene that's fucking getting to me. My man's teeth is dirty. <laughs> oh man. Oh shit. Yeah. Yeah, that's definitely old. The lady from um Insidious. She was young at this point. Oh, so she got she really got burned. So anything that can really happen in that that dream state happens to them in real life. So she even burned herself. So I wonder, can she like, can she, can they defend themselves at that point? Yeah, but how can you defend yourself against a man that's cutting his own limbs off and stabbing himself and shit? Knowing about it. How the fuck do I know? I don't expect you to believe me anyway. You ain't, you ain't gonna tell her she was all up on the ceiling and on the wall. What did he look? Look at him. Who was this? Who was this guy? He had nice fingers. Mm. Yeah, that's when it hit you. She falling asleep in the bathroom. Oh, sh oh, shit. That's that's a very vulnerable spot right there. Ah, oh, she's about to die. Blame. Oh. What, mother? Don't fall asleep in there. Come on, baby. I'm okay. Are you okay? I'm okay. But I nah. You too calm to just have a dream like that. Like, I would not be uh, locking the damn door. Stay awake, fast acting. Some no dos. I'm not, mm -mm, I'm not going to sleep. And if I can't, I'm sleeping in the bed with my mama. Nope, I'm curled up with my mama. Mm -mm, not doing it. Do you believe in the boogeyman? No. Rod killed Tina, and you know that. Nah. I've got a crazy favor to ask you. Are you still watching? Yeah, so. Just check. <laughs> oh shit. Glenn! Is she asleep? Glenn! What? No! Glenn! Oh yeah, she's asleep. I 
not about to make it like he hangs himself. We have reason to believe that there might be something very strange going on here. Got no argument with that. Damn, Nike sponsored the shit out of this movie. Okay, his death wasn't that bad. You're saying somebody else killed Tina. Who? I don't know who he is. But he's burned. And he wears a weird hat. And a red and green sweater, really dirty. Oh shit, they know about he it. Uses these knives. Like giant fingernails. They know about him. Oh shit. You better keep her whole for a few days until she really gets over the shock of this. I've got something better. Did they? Like, did they survive this? Like, did they go through it? No, nah, no, nah, because if they went through it, they wouldn't be this shocked. They, it's something else. Or maybe, uh,. It was other murders. I don't see why you could like that was like 10, 15, 20 years Everyone's prior. Got to dream, young lady. The nightmare now would be plus or minus five or six. She's about three. Her shit gonna be out of ten. Doctor, what's she doing now? Is she asleep or awake? Something's wrong. Fifteen, twenty. What's she doing? Take her ass up. She grabbed his hand. Something out from my dream. Where did you get that? I grabbed it off his head. Yeah, you better believe his ass now. You better believe his ass now. You saw her ass being tucked up under that bed. Ain't no way she pulled a hat out of her ass. Ain't no way. You better believe her now. What the hell she got? Is that vodka? You didn't sleep at all last night, did you? Hell no. Nah. You see what I be going through? You know, the doctor says you have to sleep or you'll go even crazier. You'll feel better when you get some sleep. Feel better? You call this feeling better? I'm gonna get you grab that bottle and veg out with me. Mm. Avoid everything happening to me by just getting good and low in. Ooh. Damn. She struck a nerve. Fred Kruger can't come after you, Nancy. Oh. He's dead. And you're dead. Oh, she knew. They know of Fred Kruger. Something I made up. Mm -mm -mm. Nancy, it's just a nightmare. Nah, you lying. She's a liar, a liar. <clears throat> she know about Freddy Krueger. Question is, what is what is it that she know about him? And if you can't do that, you sleep. But what if they meet a monster in their dreams? Then what? They turn their back on her. Take away its energy and it disappears. It would if only it was that easy. They don't do that. Well, then I guess those people don't wake up to tell what happens. <laughs> Come down to the cellar with me and I'll tell you. I'm not going down there. You acting crazy. Is she asleep? That's the good thing about this movie. You don't know if she's asleep or she's up. He was a filthy child murderer who killed at least 20 kids in the neighborhood. Hmm. Oh, damn. It drove us crazy when we didn't know who it was. What the fuck? Is that his claws? They put him away. The lawyers got fat and the judge got famous, but somebody forgot to sign a search warrant in the right place and Kruger was free just like that. What the fuck? What did you do, Mother? We found him in an old abandoned boiler room where he used to take his key. Oh, they did it. They did some street justice. 
Damn, they killed Freddy Krueger. Hey, that's some G shit. <laughs> they took took justice into their own hands. He's dead, honey, because mommy killed him. That's why her ass be drinking all the damn time. I even took his knives. Why? Why? Why did you just take his knife? Why? Why did you take evidence that you guys murdered my man? How long has it been since you slept? Coming up on the seventh day. It's okay. Damn. Cast records eleven. Listen, Glenn. I know who he is. Who? The killer. You do? Why would anybody want to kill me? <laughs> Why would anybody Listen, want to kill any of them? Nailing the guy when I bring him out. Bring him out of what? Meanwhile. Meanwhile. Whatever you do. Don't go to sleep. Don't fall asleep. You know he good for it. Midnight. Yeah, he's sleep right now. It's a wrap. It's crazy, man. You not having that much sleep. Have you guys ever tried to function? Being tired, not even just staying up for like a whole day, but just trying to stay up when you just sleepy? That shit is rough. It's the two admirers. Just watch it. Miss Nude America's gonna be on tonight. <laughs> How can you hear what she's going to say? Who cares what she says? <laughs> <laughs> I want you to go to bed. The nightmare's over. Get your drunk ass away from me, ma. You're not gonna be satisfied till she. I was gonna say wake up dead, but fall asleep and die. She hid a whole coffee machine next to the bed and mug under the pillow. It's like a crackhead with caffeine. You probably should've got stitches for that. If it's bleeding like that. Light still on. She got alcohol tucked away in the linen closet. Oh yeah, she a real she a real life out like. Don't you call her. You have to talk to him tomorrow. You're just gonna be firm with these kids. That's all. Let's go. <laughs> Man, he been asleep for about three hours. <laughs> She sleep. She knocked out. Oh, brilliant. Yeah, her ass is. She fell asleep her damn self. Ugh. That was gross. La, la. Damn, she blasted. You left it all up. I had to. And so you are going to get some sleep tonight. Oh shit, is Johnny Depp about to die? He about to be killed by the TV. Oh shit. Oh. He got sucked in to the bed. They did this. They flipped the whole room upside down. You don't need a stretcher up there. You need a mop. He said, You don't need a stretcher. You need a mop. Damn. I know this. I know this movie had people freaked out to even sleep in the bed after that shit. Yeah, I'll get him right away. Uh, bleh. Oh, she actually making some booby traps. So yeah, so I, I think I might be right. She can actually take shit with her. So this is supposed to be like a scary home alone. All right, she about the Macaulay Culkin and shit. What came out first? This on Home Alone. I'm about to look. I'm pretty sure this came out. This is probably how they got the idea of Home Alone. Yeah, Home Alone came out in 1990. This was. Eighty-five. So we understand why she's an alcoholic. You know, they essentially murdered a guy. I love you. 
Here's the thing, Johnny Depp wasn't dreaming about him. Like I'm, I'm just just cycling back. Johnny Depp never had a dream about him. He just happened to go to sleep. So even though okay, it didn't seem like Freddy was after him, he still was able to kill you play in your court. him. Here's the other thing, like, do we only I know he kills kids, but I'm thinking like in other movies, is this does it always remain to be kids or do we ever kill any adults? And now I lay me. Okay, so that's her cross. And that was old dude switchblade, so it's like he's taking trophies as well. God, that's his headphones. Drenched in blood, Glenn, down. Oh, so you don't have his hat. He probably pissed like, yo, where the hell my damn hat at? Give me my goddamn hat. So that didn't work. Oh. Okay, so that did work. Oh god. That had to hurt. Come on, okay. Let me no, 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 no. be crazy. She was just dreaming this whole time. She's not gonna be down there. Oh my god. Nancy, what the hell is going on? Parker, get up here. We've got a fire up here too. Oh, okay. I'm so mad at her daddy right now. <laughs> like, what the fuck? Like, what the fuck? That was weird. It's too late, Kruger. I know the secret now. This is just a dream. You're not alive. This whole thing is just a dream. Okay, yeah, right? Alrighty. Boy, you scared the heck out of me. Go ahead, I'm watching a scary movie. I'll be out in a little bit, okay? Feeling better? Okay, hold on. Oh, I feel like a million bucks. Some scared shit out of me, y'all. <laughs> oh, shit. All right. So, was, oh, so she just walked out. It's bright. So all she had to do was denounce him, essentially. It's gonna burn off sooner. It wouldn't be so bright. Nah, what the hell is going on? Oh, hell no. Nah. Is she dead? Oh, Is she in heaven? <laughs> she died last night. Hey! Yo. I'm not doing what's it. What's going on with the window? No! 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 Uh, no! 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 In a Freddy Krueger color car. Hell no. Nah. So she thought denouncing him was gonna work. There we have it. So, what did that mean? Like, obviously, whatever that whole thing she did did not work for obvious reasons. Question is, is she dead? Is she going crazy? Is she gonna be in a mental institution in the second one? 
we don't see her die. So I'm not sure what happens. The only thing I know is that Freddy is still alive. He's still doing his thing. Obviously because there's like four or five more movies after this. Uh, but yeah, I, I'm, in, I'm intrigued to see what happens in the next one. I'm definitely going to watch them. Um, it was crazy because it's like some parts of the movie... I'm like, okay, yeah, this is cheesy. Like, like the first encounter of Freddy, I'm like, okay, this is comical. This is maybe because I'm in a different time period. This came out, what, 30, 36, 7 years ago, whatever. I'm like, yeah, this is going to be, this is going to be cake. But then that first death scene hit, that shit hit a little different. Like, so, um, no, I, I really enjoyed it. Can't wait to see the, another, uh, the next one. Um. I don't know what other scary movie that I'm going to do next. I know I got Exorcism on the list. Uh, Children of the Corn, never seen that. Pet Cemetery. so just, just to name a few. Um, I'm also going to get into probably like the Jason series. And then um, Evil Dead. Yeah, a lot of these movies that I was afraid to watch when I was a kid. So I'm going to definitely get into it. So hopefully you enjoyed yourselves on night two of this 30 or 31 nights of uh, scary movies for the month of October. If you enjoyed yourself, make sure you like, make sure you subscribe. Also, um, consider becoming a member. Uh, members uh, have a heavy influence as far as what I watch. And if there's anything in particular, you can tip so that way I do the movie that you want to do. And then also there's giveaways involved as well. And then you can see your shout outs and your name at the bottom. Um, with that being said, I'd like to thank you guys. I appreciate y'all. Love you. Uh, what was your favorite death scene? Like, I think um, the one that probably freaked me out was probably the first one. Like, when, you know, she was going up the walls and stuff. I think that was pretty cool. And then Johnny Depp just getting swallowed by the bed. That was crazy, too. You know, the second death, when my man's hanging himself, that wasn't, that wasn't freaky at all. Um, but, yeah. And then Nancy, as you see, I'm not sure if she's about to die. I'm not sure if she's just stuck in the dream world. I'm not sure. She's probably in a coma. That's, 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 that's my guess. She's in a coma, and she's just being tortured by Freddy this entire time. I think that would be a good premise for the second one. But anyway, I digress. Well, again, thanks again. I love y'all. Appreciate y'all. And I will catch you guys on the next reaction. Until then, peace. Yep, I wasn't scared at all.